Now farmers from the North Reef region are now calling on the government to offtake their produce as this season's maize harvest commences. They further want prices contained to shield them from losses. In a move that will boost Kenya's food security, farmers in the North Rift are calling on the government to purchase their maize through the National Cereals and Produce Board. Wanunua maindi. Wafungwe cereals, watunulia ukulima maindi. Sababu, vile maindi na inaenda, njaa itako inji. Terekali, yuone kapsa, na tusiwe tutunawangea, tunataa tutende. Sisi nwa kulima, atufanyi biyashara ngine, indio tegemeo wetu, indio kazi yetu, indio imetuandika. Na tunuona tukienda na mna hiyo, zote tunayasa kufaulu. Na wachukue na fase kama ni siri ulo wafungue mapema. The farmers say middlemen are currently dominating the market and purchasing maize at very low prices, with the 90 kg bag dropping from 5,500 shillings a month ago to between 4,500 and 4,800 shillings. Wale middlemen, wanuno maindi kwa hali aju, na kwa jile wanuno wanuno watu ya kwenda ya biyashara. So, hii maindi nye chukuliwa, nafikiri hii haifiki, even though the subsidized fertilizer present at the NCPB depots, the overall high cost of input continue to hinder its uptake. Mkulima mwenye atakuwa na atakuwa na maindi yake wabadilishe na mbolea sababu always mambo ya pesa ni shida. Saizi kwa vile saizi watu wanauza maindi kulipa school fees. Na wanaweza upate na maindi wabadilishe na mbolea. Eh changamoto ile ile shida ambayo inafanya wakulima wape middlemen ni kwa sababu kwa mifuko yao hakuna kitu. Karama, shule, nini, wafanyikazi kulipwa. Saa kuna inabidi upeane. Unaponunua hata mafuta ile tulikuwa tunanunua 20 liters kwa shilingi 2500 saa hii tunanunua 2500 kwa lita 12 ya diesel. So hakuna kazi. So kila kitu imepanda kama ni matatu hivyo, kama ni chini ya kuondesha, kama ni mambo ya tractor na mambo ya kulima. Maize import has been on the rise with data from the Kenya National Bureau of Statistics revealing that Kenya imported 2.5 million 90 kg bags of maize in the period between April and June this year compared to 656,227 bags of the grain in the second quarter of last year. It spent 6.2 billion shillings or more than four times what it paid in April-June period of 2021. Now keep Kimboy, KTN News. Now, living in a digital 